Hello and welcome everybody to a let's play of Hogwarts Legacy. I got this as a gift from my wife and I'm excited to check it out. Um, I started looking at it and actually started recording but then realized that right after this screen comes character creation which is a thing that I'm very slow at and <laughs> meticulous. So. I tried to pause and then realized that I can't pause my recordings. Um, so I'm starting again so that I have already figured out what, did I, what uh, my choices I want for the character creation. So we'll do that in a second. First of all, this letter. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry as a fifth year student. I was like, oh. I thought we'd start as a first year student, but here we are. Term begins on September 1st. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you on your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by those under the age of 17 outside school. However, due to your unique circumstances, what are those? The ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elazar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Cool. Yours sincerely, M. Weasley. Is that Ron's mom? Is she, uh, she deputy headmistress? Um, Molly Weasley, right? I think is her name. Um, I should say that my knowledge of Harry Potter is well somewhere in the middle i'd say i'm not like at all one of the people who's like expert and remembers everything and knows everything and but um not like a huge on on the lower level and all that uh but i read the books when they came out and enjoyed those a lot and saw the movies and had fun with those um that's kind of the extent of it so yeah uh if there's like lore things that I miss are cool like easter eggs and stuff like that I'd love it if somebody who saw this like left comments to let me know about that stuff that'd be cool okay let's start game so let's see did it remember my choices yeah it did so I, w I didn't go with a preset I went with this and I thought maybe the story for his scarring here would be that um, kind of drawing from my own life a little bit, and although I don't have a scar like this, uh, if he saw somebody being like bullied one time, and he tried to step in and help, it's like uh, it just hurts. Don't want to see that person getting uh, mistreated. So it's like I'm gonna step in the way, and caught this. Wow. And yep, there you go. That's the face. Um, dee 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 dee. What else have we got here? The voices, higher and lower pitch. I thought I might adjust the pitch, but then it sounded a little bit wonky when you go off of the main pitch. So, like, I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. A few cobwebs and some dust. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. I feel like you could hear like a synthesized that was quite something. sound. I'm eager to... I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I gather that uh, when the game first came out, this was worse, but... A few cobwebs and some dust. This just Nothing sounds to be concerned about. cleaner. So I think I'll just leave it right there. Difficulty normal seems uh, fine for me. Mori Soul wizard let's go let's go ah it appears we are almost ready to depart it's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting i presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on i have professor well I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. 
You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. What's that work? Seems like you're wary of something. Sketchy things are afoot. The music is great. Companion. A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. Huh. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term began. Oh, that's our well, circumstance. you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you? Wait. We do not know. Whoa. Where's George? The key! 
<laughs> yeah, so why are they saying Akio? <laughs> Did George not survive? Are you right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Wigan World? Nice. G to heal. What happened? Poor George. Oh. I can't believe he... What Did the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would, but stay close. We've no idea who created this port key, or why. Wasn't it his wife who sent the key? I thought that's what had been said. I also didn't catch what the uh, newspaper article was saying. Something about goblins, but let's look around. He's going that way, but I want to look at what's in the cave. Anything here we can pick up? Also, by default, the uh, the game suggested that my computer should run on low, and uh, I don't know if I'll tinker with trying to turn the settings up and see if it still runs smoothly. Um, but it depends. I don't know if it'll like how much better it'll look or if it'll slow me down a lot. Caribou. All right, doesn't look like I can pick up these mushrooms or anything. Oop to do. I've got long socks over my pants. I think. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage travelled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So, those ruins. You the port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path however faded it may be. Okie dokie. I'll look, Mind your step. I'll look around over here first. Anything in these? Pots? I don't know how you pick things up. What are the keys? <laughs> like hopped over that pot. Okay. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Space jet climb. Standard. Well, ancient go. magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. I hope I'm not missing things, like maybe I could pick up plants or look in these pots or something, but I don't know how. So, on we go. But sir... Why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. 
spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Mm -hmm. Good point, good point. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Basic cast, new spell unlocked. Tap left click to perform a basic cast, okay. Excellent! Use your camera to select an active target. I'm not sure what it's showing me there. Is that mouse wheel? Or just move your, move your mouse around? Maybe it's just move your mouse around. So who you're aimed at will get highlighted. Okay. Oh, I'm actually supposed to do... Wait, what are they doing here? Oh, I see. I have to hold space. Whoa. was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Okay. Your one works improving with every cast. Is Thank it? you, sir. Thanks. Now I'm like opening the jugs because I can. I'm targeting one. I'm like, well, maybe something's inside. That one went off the side. Oops. Like, hey, careful where you're aiming that thing. Ah, oh, up there. What do you see up there? Oh, big climber. Spry for his age. Interesting. You don't have to like wait We're for the whole. We're close uh, now. It's just ahead. For the whole animation, like when there's multiple targets, it looks like if I click quickly, it, it goes quicker. Steady yourself. Repair. Looks like I'm again to beat up there. We are. I see lions, torches. This place is cool. Goblet on the ground. Sorry, while I break all pots. Here. I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Yeah, okay. Let's investigate. Oh, mini map shows your surroundings. With you, the purple shape, whatever that you call that shape, in the middle. This yellow and black marker is your current objective. Okay. Purple's me. That's the objective. Press and hold V to toggle quest objective details. Oh, okay. The path to Hogwarts. Professor Fig and I have traveled via Portkey to a remote cliffside in the Scottish Highlands. Ah, you don't care how long I've wanted to be in the Scottish Highlands. We need to explore the mysterious ruins that we suspect the portkey was meant to lead us to. Explore the ruins. Cool. Just minimizing that. Let's look. Let's look around. Oh, 
The statue is of interest. Investigate. Professor, this statue... This may have been his home. Why is this wise man holding a large cantaloupe? <laughs> Could be a honeydew? Nah, too big. What's going on out here? I wonder if, like, there's gonna never be anything in one of these pots and I'm just being silly. Blasting them all. Who knows? I should maybe go back to the Oh, wow. Broke a group of them. Nothing? Neat. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what uh, could it be blocking? Oh, oh, oh. That looks like where we're going to head, but I want to go back and see if there was more things. I was worried for a second there, like, it was just going to auto-complete the area. It was like, oh, you reached this thing. <clears throat> but I want to look around still. Thankfully, it did not pull me in. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, that's cool. I like the feel of it. Nothing. Just a lot of wand work. Okay. Investigate. Before the game investigates for me, what do we see? Is that the same old guy? Probably. Maybe not. Maybe not. Uh oh, gotta sneeze. Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, he's got like slight tarot cards out there or something. Maybe that's the crystal ball he was holding. The bird in the tree. A bunch of books around. He's got his telescope out. A number of stars there. Neat. Okay, I don't see anything that jumps out to me as important. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. Why a seer? It is interesting. Seems to be a scholarly guy interested in lots of reading and understanding the universe. Okay. Uh, is he going to just stay here? We have to go around the way I had found before. <laughs> Just jumping for fun. <laughs> There's a symbol here. Doesn't mean anything to me. What's this? Professor Fig. That, uh... that me? How Fake. odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. Cool. Interact with magic. Okay. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? <laughs> I don't believe it. to the objective there. I see like a chest over here. 
Yeah. Okay. Oh, my completionist ways are kicking in. I don't know if it's exactly completionist. My need to explore everything and check I haven't missed something. <laughs> Sounds like completionist, although I don't know that. I feel like completionist also want is like somebody who wants to do every single side quest, complete every achievement, that kind of thing. And I don't think. That's how I usually play. But then again, how well do I know myself? Who's snoring? Is the book snoring? Or is there something on there? Is this gonna be something we ride? It looks like. Back there. Oh, wait. There's somebody asleep here. Hello. Hello. Thank you. Is it gonna be the goblin from the newspaper? Oh, it is a goblin. Kevin <coughs> Baker snorting. Snoring, not snorting. <coughs> Saw in the porky container. No, darker. 
I saw that same glow in the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Cool, Charlie. Here we are. Where is it? Where are we? When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12. Until today. Ancient. Ancient vault. Always cool. Vault 12. Thank you for your help. And how did his wife come to have a key to the, the ancient vault? What's going on here? Oh, nice. Found something. Now I want to check everything, and I hope they'll teach us soon what the key is to move quicker. This is some slow walking. A lot of slow moseying. <laughs> Don't find me, everybody. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Best of luck. Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Oh, check this out. Steady your wand with the mouse, guided along the symbol's path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wand's motion along the symbol path. Huh. Okay. Do I have to click? Steady your wand. Guide along the path. Well, it's not uh, prompting me. I wonder if I have to press space to start it. Okay, let's try. Yeah. Oops. Oh, I messed it up. All right, all right. Revelio. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. Will do, but I want to look around first now that I have the opportunity. Some scrolls, goblets, numbered shelves. Uh, who lit the candles? Well, it's magical, so. I was gonna say, hey, that wax lasted a long time. If these were lit when this place was first set up. Some newspapers. Okay, let's try this again. Revelio! A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Let's do it. Let's go. Lumos! 
This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. Do I have to stay close? I look around. What's, uh... Revelio. Revelio is still on my screen, so I was just trying it. Can I do... Lumos? Oh. Uh-oh. What? Oh, L goes to here? I see. Oh, I could save here. Sure, we can save. Game saving is currently available. Auto saves may be performed during this time. Oh, okay. We can't do it right here. Um, I tried L for, to see if it would uh, do Lumos. That's what happened there. Revelio. Uh, I can't see anything. Oh, I think I do see something, actually. Wait, where is he going? Come back this way, Professor. There's a, uh... I think there's a box here. I caught a glimpse of, but... I don't know. Oh, oh! Okay, I'm coming back! I'm coming back! <laughs> I did... I do think I saw a box over there. Can you look that way with your light? See? Something right there on the edge. Oh, it gets darker when I walk away from him. But, like, right there. Let's see if we can walk that way. Revelio. Nope. Okay, let's go back. I tried. Okay, where are we off to, Professor? Ah, it's tantalizing. There's things over at the sides. Maybe that's another pillar, actually. Oh yeah, okay. <coughs> Excuse me. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but mm -hmm. on the floor. Can we light this little sconce? Nope. Whoa. Blue one. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Cool. Determine how to proceed. Let's see if it says more. Uh, after I took the ball, there we quickly realized... There to that reflection you're seeing. Yeah, I'll check it out. Uh, that it was empty. I saw a glowing symbol on the hidden floor, the same symbol from the working container. We tried to open the door. We suddenly found ourselves transported to the vast expanse of darkness. We were Try casting Rinkles. Revelio, perhaps. <laughs> this is certainly no ordinary one. Okay. Try casting Revelio. I took too long and he gave me a hint, but I was just curious if there was, like, uh info there under the request log. Okay, just come over here. And let's try it. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Uh -huh. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. Yes, please. Uh, same thing as before, looks like. Yeah. Okay. OK. 
Okay, we got it. Lumos. You've acquired the wand lighting charm, Lumos, which has automatically been slotted to your spell set. Lumos creates a light at the tip of your wand to help you see in dark areas. Continue. Okay, so R is Revelio, but one is Lumos. Wonder why two different systems there. Lumos, well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Okay, let's put it in. Let's line up the reflection. Uh oh, we have to fight this guy. Oh, and his buddies. We gotta protect the professor. Uh, protect him. Okay. <laughs> Adio. Defendo. Let me also depose. Nice. Depose. Expose. Oops. Oops, too soon. I was trying to defend the uh Oh I'm getting Oh no. The timing is off here. I probably didn't need to, but I just thought it would be cool to uh Try to protect the cross. Oh, that's a good way to go. Little more? You're good with that. Stay close! That was intense. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Lumos. There we go. Uh, where am I supposed to go? Revelio. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Huh? They do. Lumos. Revelio. Oh, they're behind. I think. Lumos. Revelio. Huh, okay. Lumos. Shall I look around first? Oh, this place is huge. Uh oh. I'm trying to look around, but oh, there are things. That's just gonna make me want to look around more. No, and it's like so gigantic. Does that send me back to the middle? It might. I think I go too far off to the side. I thought when it went dark, it was just dark and I was turning around to try to come back, but I think it was actually sending me back to the starting point. Hmm. I wonder if any findable stuff is fairly close to the center. But then the stuff I found wasn't that cool. It seemed to just be coins. But that's cool in its own way. 
Okay. Let's go. Let's see what this is about. I assume Revelio and turn the things to face the right way. But I'm looking around, you know. <laughs> it's telling me Caster Bell. It's like, hey, you didn't figure it out. Okay. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Can we do them one at a time, or is it like how to get them all to turn the right way at the same time? If it was that, I'd be in a position where they'd all face the right way, which would be maybe here-ish? Lumos! Uh-huh. I need to align these statues with their reflections. Yeah, I got it already. Oh, I... Okay, all I know is how to defend, and I didn't do it. Okay, I see. I have like a spidey sensor before it goes. That's the yellow. That's my timing cue. But uh, I don't know how to combat them. Oh, tap left to destroy with basic cast. Okay. <laughs> the objectives. Reveal the way forward. Oh, I didn't think of that when we were fighting uh, at the professor's side. I could have just tried basic cast. Hold Q during Protego to stun enemies with a stupefy counterattack. Hold hold Q? So instead of tapping Q. Hold it, and it'll stun them with stupid butt. Stun enemies take extra damage indicated by gold numbers. Okay. Just hold Q. We're gonna have more? Yeah. Stupid butt. Oh, I was too soon on that one. Our little wisps to follow. Revelio. Lumos. Oh, did Revelio help us find the chest? I think it did. That's good to know. Revelio. Oh, makes us stop Potato. running. Whoops. Lumos. Uh, uh, Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. I can't ha do Revelio with the lights on. Oh, hold shift to sprint. Nice. There we go. Did 
Like I want the light on, but I want to check for uh, goodies. Lumos. I'll just go a little ways and then I'll do it. Revelio. Anything? No. Lumos. Sprint. Huh, I think it's tap, not hold. I think it said hold shift, but it looks like it's a tap. Okay. Oh, it brought me right over here. Uh, looks very elvish. Find Professor Fig. Yes, please. Why do we have like red around the edges of our vision now? And are we supposed to go through that gate? I assume so. Let's go. Revelio. Yeah, I see something over there. There's like a splashy point here. Professor Fig, you were inside the chest. No, just kidding. Oh, the fires light up when we get over near them. Rebellion. See another chest on the other side. To go investigate it. Well, I think we're going straight for the door. Oh wait, what's right here in the middle? Is it the uh, luck serum in the movies? I forget what it's called. Uh, oh, there you are. How did you? What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can.
Principal. Where is it? Rackham? Rackham? No, I think it's. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access oh, only to one with the key, and you didn't have to... Oh, oh, oh. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Oh, oh more people are going to die at the start of our journey here. Come on. Go ahead, Professor Frigg. The vault is going to protect itself. Nice. Help him. Maybe we're gonna run through that way. Come on, Professor Big. I know my I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. That was a cool, cool intro. Mysteries are set up. Oh, there's 
symbols for the different houses there on the corner. Yeah, I thought that was Slytherin. That could be Gryffindor. Oh, here we are. <laughs> oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm <laughs> rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. <laughs> if you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. I'll be in touch. They say thank you. He just risked his life for us, aside from even without that showing up to help teach us. Get us caught up. Professor Weasley! We've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. So is it going to take this from my uh, Harry Potter ah, account? Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. Hmm, okay. Can we start classes or explore? Um... Hmm. Uh, explore? I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm. You do not give up easily, do you? You are undaunted by challenges that lie ahead. And your loyalty to a friend delayed your arrival here this evening. Perhaps you belong in Hufflepuff. So that's what I had in the, uh, the website, was Hufflepuff. Uh, which, to be open, I, I was like, oh, I kind of would have liked Gryffindor. Uh, honestly, anything other than Slytherin, I don't like the, uh, obviously, it's like a very, kind of, racist <laughs> house, uh, but, um, hopefully I didn't, I don't know, I don't know if I would offend anybody. I feel like that's the way the story was written, was to try to make a point, it was written originally for, like, children, right, and it, it was trying to make a point about the snobbish, arrogant, we're the best, others are mudblood, right, so... I don't think that's a defensible position. It was meant to be the bad guys, I suppose. Anyhow, if people disagree, you're welcome to write your comments. But, um, yeah, I was like, what's Hufflepuff about? 
so uh, you know I didn't know as much obviously basing it on the books and the movies uh, so I googled it before starting tonight and I was like uh, okay it's like yeah there it says patience loyalty hard work it seemed that they also said it was the most inclusive house that they didn't turn anybody away the other ones like were looking for specific qualities more I guess um, and Hufflepuff was like you're all welcome and they started Somebody founded Hogsmeade to do with Hufflepuff and some international uh, friendship situation. So I was like, yeah, I like this. This is cool. The, the f loyal friendship house sounds good to me. Um, so I don't know if the game was... It didn't ask me a bunch of questions here. Oh, choose a different one? Accept this one. Yeah, I'll accept this one. We're good. The sort who makes an entrance. Better be Hufflepuff! Give me the colors. unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said I'm sure have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm Professor Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Super warm. Super warm and Weasley. Weasley-ish. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. Might be a bit of work, but I'm sure that's never stopped you before. It hasn't, Professor. <laughs> now, here we are at the entrance to the Hufflepuff common room. This is the entrance? Indeed. I will explain what to do, but I hesitate to do it myself, as one errant knock leads to being doused in vinegar. Most unpleasant. You must tap the barrel, two from the bottom, middle of the second row, in the rhythm of Helga Hufflepuff. What happened there? The audio and the image got out of sync. done. Now go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Hmm. Sweet. Win for a spot to, uh, to save, if I can. This is already pretty long. First episode. Let's see. Cool. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Quest started. Welcome to Hogwarts. Okay. This might be our spot. Um. Yeah. Before I go and looking around exploring this room, which I'm eager to do, I think I'll see if I can save here. complete. Beautiful, okay. So, I think we'll leave it right there. 
and pick this up next time. That was really, really cool. I'm in no way let down. I'm excited about this. It looks really good. Yeah, and this will be a great game. All right, see you all next one. Love you all, keeping good to each other.